Hey guys, welcome back. New hair, who this? Ah, it's Ta. Um, if you're new, thanks for joining us today. I really appreciate you. Um, yes, I went to get my hair done today. My grays were getting on my nerves. I needed a trim. Like, I cut a good bit off. So, new hair. All right, so today's video, I'm super excited because I have an idea and I hope you guys want to join in as well. If you remember a couple Dollar Tree hauls back, I bought this, the color, the USA um, map thing. Well, I never read the packaging. I just picked up two of them because I was like, oh, one for me and one for Abby. Okay, these things come with six pages in them, double-sided, all the same. You have this side where it's just the, um, what is it called? Like the abbreviation state thing. And on the back you have, this land is my land and it shows the symbols like where the mountains are, the grasslands, and it tells you what color to color them. But our fo my focus is gonna be on this side. So this is not my original idea but I did see it and I thought it was really, really cool. So, I would love to be able to exchange 50 cards with you guys. And what I mean by that is a state card. I saw this in one of my card making groups on Facebook and they're doing it in there and I figured we could try it here. You make a card, like a greeting card, and you decorate it with things from your state. Um, whether that be state colors, state flowers, state bird. Um, just think of like a postcard when you see them from your state, some of the stuff that's on there, and you make it on a greeting card. So I figured every time I got one from a different state, I would color it in. And if you guys want to join in on this and you don't have a map, let me know. I have um, 10 of them because there's six in that other pack that I have right there. And then this came with six. So I'm gonna give one to Abby because I did say one was for her. So technically I have 11. Yeah. Six, one, two, three. No, it's 10, okay. So 10 maps. So if you guys wanna do this with me, when you send me a card, I will send you one back. And the first 10 people who need a map, I will put the map in your card as, uh, like whenever I mail it out to you. So you can have your own map you don't have, I know it's only a dollar, but if I'm already mailing you something, I could just slip this piece of paper in there. So, like I said, I have 10 extra maps. If anybody is needing one, um, then after the 10, obviously, I'm out. But, so I thought this was a really neat idea. So, I'm going to get, I haven't made any yet, but um, basic, I think I'm going to use, I'm trying to see if I still have them right here. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> I have these. These are, I think these are the pre-made ones I had from the Dollar General. And I think you get, uh, these might not be from Dollar General. But Dollar General does have them. They're white pre-made cards out of card stock with an envelope inside. Um, I think you get 10 or 12 to a pack. But I think this came out of, um, if you guys remember when I did Michael's Boxes a while back. Not the last set, but a couple sets ago. I got those, um, there was a thing for brides uh, invitations, and I think this came from those. But regardless, this is just a, um, I think it's a 5 by 7 card, but you can do any size. And you decorate it with things, like I can put, um, I can cut out the state of Louisiana, like in one color, and then I can decorate the red, like Mardi Gras, or I can do something with crawfish, I can do something with gumbo. Um, the state bird, the state flower. I can use all of that. And on the inside, um, you can put like a little greeting, like a message and sign it. Or I was thinking for me, there's a couple things um, like phrases. When you hear a certain phrase, sometimes you'll think of a certain state. So I thought about that too. Or maybe put some state facts in it or something. So if you guys are interested, let me know. I'm going to get started on making my Louisiana cards. Hopefully you guys would like to swap with me. And you would send me, say you're from, let's go with Nevada. If you are from Nevada, send me a card, decorate it like your state. And then sign it. If you have a channel, put your channel name. 
all that good stuff. And I will send you a Louisiana card. So hopefully you guys want to join in. There is no deadline to this. This I can work on. You know, we can. it might take us a year before we complete a map. But yeah, so. And you can easily send one. If I, even if I already have that state, send it anyway. And I can kind of keep a tally on it as well. Like, if I just colored it in, that meant I got one card. But if, like, say I use a black marker and I put a one, okay, that meant I have two cards because I got tally marks on it now. So I just thought it was really neat idea. Neat idea. So, let me know. All right, let's look at the calendar. So, today is Wednesday, February 24th. And like we said yesterday, it is World Bartender Day today. So, if you're a bartender, it's your day. Tomorrow... It's going to be really hard, and I don't think I'm going to complete this. I don't think I'll be able to get down with the get down on this challenge here. Um, tomorrow is Thursday, February 25th. It is National Don't Utter a Word Day. I'm sorry. I like to open this thing. I like to talk. So that's going to be a really hard day for me. Maybe I'll have like a moment like a window I'll be like okay for this many minutes don't talk to me because I can't talk to you because it's don't utter a word day maybe I can take a section of that and make it um, you know make it about the national day so before I go I want to show you one more thing and I got a book in I know another book I know but I pre-ordered this one um, I want to say I ordered this in November and then I kind of forgot about it. And then I went on my Amazon account and I saw that it was um, still sitting there in the orders. And I'm like, what? It's like, oh, wait, it was a pre-order. I never got it. So this is The Jackal by J.R. Ward. And it is one of the Black Dagger Brotherhood, um, like, spinoffs, I guess. Yeah, black. this is part of the Black Dagger Brotherhood. Um and this is called Prison Camp. Like, it's part of the prison camp. So, this is like another mini, I guess, series off of the main series. I absolutely j love J.R. Ward. I love the Black Dagger Brotherhood series. I love the other one they did with, like, the younger generation. Really enjoyed that one. So, now I'm going to see what this prison camp is all about. And this, like I said, the hardcover came out a while ago. But this just got released um first pocket book paperback edition march 2021 um so yeah these are paperback always releases after the fact and i think this is part of the mass market um paperbacks not the official paperback i guess but anyway so that was the other thing i had today Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you check down in the description. See if there's any links you would like to click. And I will see you guys next time. Bye, y'all.